Hey, we are Pampot, Pampotazo. <laughs> and we are here in Madrid. Techno. Uh, it's a hard question because I really like horse, but... Okay, uh, let me answer for him, Techno. <laughs> oh yeah, these days Techno, yeah. Ooh. Mornings. Nights. Clubs. Clubs. I would say right now, for me, it's still the Watergate in Berlin because I really liked, we have like so many good nights there. I can't tell. It wouldn't, it wouldn't be fair to yes. choose just one, so uh, many clubs. Mm, po. The favorite festival I've ever been was the Burning Man. It was for me like outstanding. There's another thousand festivals, that's say the same as clubs, but Burning Man was for me really outstanding. I have to say the same answer again, <laughs> like too many good festivals, to be honest. <laughs> I have a list. <laughs> it's actually two artists. So one lady, one gentleman, and the lady is Cora Novoa from, she lives in Barcelona. She will have a release on our label Second State very soon. And she is, like the stuff she does, does right now is really cool, cool shit. I really like it, I really dig it. And uh, the gentleman Rove Ranger from Stuttgart. I have also one, I have a house DJ. A DJ, uh, she called Anna Schreit. I'm a really big fan of her. She, Anna Schreit, keep it in mind, Anna Schreit. I would say because we've just uh, spent some time with him, or like them, I need to also say two of them. Enrico San Giuliano. Yes, with Enrico we have. And um, then we also need to call, say Charlotte de Witte and yeah. René Sonnefeld. Story, it's a story we've, we've been telling uh, many times already. It was a long time ago in Amsterdam for some kind of festival and it was raining hard and uh, Thomas <laughs> had to go to the Dixie toilet uh, oh, yeah. to do big business before the show and uh, the toilet paper was gone. So he used his white tennis socks. <laughs> the day after, uh, his feet without socks uh, and full of mud and everything, that was the strange situation then, to be honest. <laughs> yes, it was summer, my shoes are wet without socks, and you know, in summer, wet, wet, wet shoes, it starts getting stinky, so I went to the airport next day without showering, and the guy from the security checked told me like, oh, you look strange. Can you, can you put your shoes off? And I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> and it was really strange. It was really like, uh, I, felt, I felt like a bad, bad boy <laughs> with stinky, stinky feet. Uh, 